Hey guys, in this video, we are going to take a look at another USB ROM called as Seen in OS for a Redmi 5 Plus or the Redmi Note 5 Indian variant. And it's running on Android 9 and the version is going to something. So, without wasting more time, let's start. So, we are starting with the home screen. As you can see, we get the launcher launcher. So, we have all the launcher settings. And I have already made a video on launcher. So, if you want, you can check it out. Then we have these apps like uh, like applied some customizations for the launcher and these are the apps like squared icons present ed, like by default then i have some of my apps present and i haven't much use like it's a one day usage let's go to system about phone you can see uh devices set to redmi 5 plus so the product model is not set dynamically and you can see see in os cake so android version 9 so it's Android Pie with latest November security patch and yes with this new animation and we have here some space to draw I don't know what like Google has added with the new Android uh, 9.0 November patch let's take a look at the settings and stuff and into the settings you can see we have display and we have the normal options with ambient display and always on display but this may be a harm to the uh, LCD screen of our Redmi Note 5 and into the Siri extras we get only two options others are blank you can see three options and navigation is blank so this is the source's working progress so this is just an initial build so you can expect more stuff soon and also we have voltage old, icon but it's not getting displayed for me so I don't know if it's with you just Tell me in the comments if it's working or maybe the source is still incomplete and work in progress. The ROM has maybe a snap camera or Google camera. I haven't tested. Okay, so it has this normal Google camera, not the modded one. And yes, pictures come really great. So great means it's like the one. But when you apply the flash, you get this green. I don't know why we're getting that green thing. But yeah, with the camera and also let's test the front camera. So if selfies were good, enable the front selfie. Okay, so front is working good. So you can click selfies, but if you're not a fan of normal mode, <laughs> then you can go like if you click a lot of selfies, then you can go for now guys talking about the performance and battery. Now I have worse experiences with the performance. This from lags a lot. Also, it has suck kernel, but still it lags a lot. So it's using it as default. I don't know why it lags. Also, PUBG has lags and battery is not up to that par. You can see how much it's dropped now. I don't know. It's 40, 47 now, but it has been dropping uh, far much like in idle time. And I don't know how much more battery I'll be able to save for the day. So this is how the battery backup is. It's not that good. I haven't used this device as much as I should, but still it's the second cycle and I should expect some more from this. And yeah, nothing else. Uh, uh, that's it for the fair and quick review for the Serino S. If you guys like this video, press the like button. If you like Serino S also like the, press the like button. If you don't, press the dislike button and your opinions and feedback will be in the comment section. And for more such videos on the Redmi 5 Plus or Redmi Note 5, just click the subscribe button and the bell icon if you just want to in case and bye bye i'll see you guys in the next video then bye bye